This cat owner meted out harsh and cruel treatment to his cat, tying him on a leash and abandoning him. But days later, something truly incredible happened. Jasper was an adorable cat, sleek and beautiful, with bright orange fur that made him stand out. His agility and speed, especially in hunting down rodents, got him adopted into a loving home. With Jasper around, no one worried about rodents infesting the house. As the days passed, Henry, Jasper's owner, started to change in his care for the cat. He gradually detached from their bond, feeding Jasper less and giving him little attention. To Henry, Jasper became just a tool to control mice, not a beloved pet or emotional support. Henry's once warm demeanor turned gruff and solitary. Henry grew tired of the cat's presence in the house, no longer enjoying his cuddles or purring. And so he made a devastating decision. He took Jasper to the backyard, overgrown with grass, and tied him with a long leash and left him there. Confused and abandoned, the cat roamed the backyard, wondering why his beloved owner had left him there. He meowed plaintively, seeking comfort and companionship, but there was no one to hear him. The nights were cold and harsh for Jasper in his open-air prison, where a leash constantly restrained him from leaving the backyard. Hunger gnawed at his stomach, and he often meowed desperately, hoping for someone to notice and provide food or release him from his tether. But his cries went unanswered, and Jasper's world narrowed to the confines of the backyard, a place he once roamed freely. Henry's visits became sporadic, his face appearing less and less often in Jasper's world. On the rare occasion when Henry did come out, he would toss over leftover scraps, barely enough to sustain the poor cat. The once beloved cat now felt like a forgotten burden. Every day brought new challenges for Jasper. Despite his hunger and confinement, he remained vigilant, patrolling his small domain. Whenever a mouse or rodent dared to approach the house, he sprang into action, using his hunting instincts to keep the pest at bay. His skills were unmatched, but his heart longed for the freedom he once enjoyed. The weight of the chain around his neck grew heavier with each passing day. Jasper's body weakened from hunger and lack of appropriate care. He attempted to chew through the tough rope binding him to the post, but his efforts were in vain. His determination to break free was met with the reality of his dwindling strength. As days turned into weeks, Jasper's spirit waned. He felt the toll of neglect and loneliness, wondering what he had done to deserve such treatment. As fate would have it, a disturbing event unfolded that would further worsen Jasper's already dire situation. A stray dog, lured by the scent of mice and rodents Jasper had caught in the backyard, leapt over the fence in search of a meal. Jasper, alerted by the intruder, rose swiftly to confront the trespasser. The air crackled with aggression as the cat and dog locked eyes, ready to defend their respective domains. In a flurry of motion, Jasper launched quick strikes with his paws, deftly avoiding the dog's snapping jaws. It seemed Jasper had the upper hand until an unexpected twist of fate. The leash that bound Jasper, a constant reminder of his confinement, became a hindrance in the heat of the battle. It snagged on something, momentarily pinning Jasper down and leaving him vulnerable to the dog's attack. With a swift move, the dog capitalized on the opportunity, inflicting a serious injury on Jasper's body. Despite the setback, Jasper rallied, finding a better position to continue the fight. With determination and fierceness, he engaged the dog in a fierce struggle, refusing to back down. The dog, realizing Jasper's resilience and strength, eventually retreated, leaping back over the fence and disappearing into the streets. Even tied, Jasper had proven himself a formidable opponent. Now with the threat gone but the damage done, Jasper found himself bleeding profusely from the dog's bite. Weak and in pain, he licked his wounds, his meows growing weaker as he called for help. His cries echoed in the empty backyard, a plea for aid that went unanswered. As days turned into nights, Jasper's condition continued to deteriorate. The combination of hunger, frustration, and pain from his injury weighed heavily on him. Despite his worsening state, the cat continued to meow. Henry, unmoved and unbothered by Jasper's distress, ignored his cries. With each ignored meow, 
Jasper's hope dimmed further. As time marched on, the cat's injury took a turn for the worse. The wound, left untreated and exposed to the elements, festered and caused him increasing pain. He was in desperate need of help, and he needed it urgently before it was too late. As days passed with Henry remaining indifferent to Jasper's pleas, an extraordinary event unfolded. It all began when Lily, a little girl who lived next door, ventured near Henry's backyard during her daily walk with her beloved kitten, Pebble. Pebble, despite being a chubby and often teased by Lily's dad for her laziness, held a special place in Lily's heart. On that particular day, as Lily carried Pebble past Henry's backyard, a change came over Pebble. The normally placid cat suddenly became agitated, meowing loudly and displaying signs of distress. This behavior was unusual for Pebble, prompting Lily to pay closer attention to her furry companion. Sensing something amiss, Pebble gestured to be let down from Lily's arms. Intrigued and slightly concerned, Lily complied, wondering what could be troubling her usually relaxed cat. While part of her wondered if Pebble was simply hungry and craving food, another instinct told her that something deeper was at play. As Lily set Pebble down, the cat made a beeline for the fence, separating Henry's backyard from the street. Her meows grew more urgent, indicating that she had sensed distress on the other side of the fence. Lily, now fully engaged in the mystery unfolding before her, followed Pebble's lead. She fetched a log of wood to boost her height, allowing her to peer into the overgrown area beyond the fence. As Lily scanned the bushy environment, her heart sank at the heartbreaking sight that met her eyes. A cat, weak and faint, meowed feebly in distress. Lily strained to hear the cat's plea, but Pebble's keen senses had already detected the fellow creature's distress. The sight tore at Lily's heartstrings, and she couldn't help but cry out in shock and anguish. The cat's eyes, filled with a plea for help, spoke volumes of its suffering. Lily noticed the leash that restricted the cat's movements, adding to its misery. Flies swarmed around the cat's wound, highlighting the neglect and abandonment it had endured. Lily's heart broke as she witnessed the cat's dire condition, realizing the extent of its suffering and neglect. The beautiful fur was now unkempt and dirty. Lily couldn't comprehend how someone could be so indifferent to the cat's plight, leaving it in such a distressing condition. Determined to help, Lily knew she couldn't turn a blind eye to the cat's suffering. As Lily pondered how to help Jasper, she took out her phone and recorded a short video of the cat, a small but crucial step in raising awareness about his plight. She planned to show it to her dad, hoping it would spur him into action to rescue the innocent cat. Descending from the log of wood, her face transformed from sadness to tears, touched by the emotional moment of Pebble's compassion. Despite being labeled lazy by her dad, Pebble had shown empathy towards a fellow creature in need, inspiring Lily to do whatever it took to rescue Jasper. However, Lily faced a challenge as her father was away on a business trip, leaving her in the care of her grandmother. Reluctant to burden her grandmother with the distressing situation she had witnessed, Lily resolved to help Jasper until her dad returned. That same evening, she grabbed a can of tuna fish, and with determination in her heart, tossed it over the fence to Jasper, who was starving. Climbing onto the log to get a better view, Lily watched as Jasper eagerly sniffed and devoured the tuna fish, his hunger momentarily alleviated amidst the pain of his injuries. Her heart swelled with a mix of emotions, from sadness at Jasper's suffering to hope that her small acts of kindness could make a difference in his life. Lily's heart sank as she contemplated how long Jasper must have endured hunger without food. Feeling too young to confront Mr. Henry, Jasper's neglectful owner, she decided to wait for her dad's return from the business trip before taking further action. However, she formulated a plan to help the hungry cat regain strength by feeding him whenever she had the opportunity, throwing in pieces of treats like fish to sustain him. True to her promise, Lily visited Jasper regularly over the following days, offering him bits of food to alleviate his hunger and provide some comfort. Despite Henry's neglect, Jasper found solace in the presence of Lily and Pebble, who had heard his pleas for help and responded with kindness. As time passed, a connection grew between Lily and Jasper. The cat began to recognize her face and eagerly anticipated her visits. 
Knowing that she brought not only food, but also a sense of care and compassion, Jasper longed for the day when he would be freed from the confines of his leash and granted the freedom he so desperately craved. Soon, Lily's father, Brian, returned from his business trip and was delighted to reunite with his daughter. However, he couldn't ignore the sadness in Lily's eyes, which became apparent during dinner. Brian gently inquired about what was bothering her, opening the door for Lily to share her discovery. Lily, who had been waiting for the right moment, seized the opportunity to explain everything to her father. She also showed Brian the videos she had recorded, tears streaming down her face as she recounted the cat's plight. To Lily's surprise, Brian recognized the cat in the videos as Jasper. He recalled Jasper's presence during his rare visits to Henry's house, admiring the cat for his beautiful fur and intelligence. Brian had noticed Jasper's absence, but hadn't given it much thought until now, realizing the dire situation the cat had been in all along. Tears welled up in Brian's eyes. Brian knew he couldn't let Jasper suffer any longer. He felt a deep sense of responsibility to help the cat and make things right. As the conversation continued, Lily and Brian discussed possible ways to rescue Jasper and provide him with the care and treatment he desperately needed. Their shared empathy and determination strengthened their bond, and they had a shared mission to save the cat. The following day, Brian confronted Henry about his treatment of Jasper, showing him the videos from Lily's phone. As Henry watched the videos, his expression changed from defense to despair. Tears welled up in his eyes, and he began to cry uncontrollably, shocking Brian and Lily. They exchanged confused and surprised glances, unsure of how to react as they try to console Henry in his moment of emotional breakdown. Amidst his tears, Henry revealed the painful truth behind his actions. He explained that his late wife had adored Jasper deeply, and the cat had been a source of comfort and companionship after her passing. Jasper's purring and comforting presence had helped Henry cope with the grief of losing his beloved wife, but over time, the cat's reminders of his late wife became too much for him to bear. Henry, still reeling from his loss, decided to distance himself emotionally by using Jasper as a guard cat, chaining him in the backyard as a means of solitude. His actions stemmed from a place of profound grief and a desire to be alone, away from reminders of his painful loss. As Henry shared his heartbreaking story, Brian and Lily were deeply touched and empathetic. They realized the depth of Henry's sorrow and understood why he had treated Jasper the way he did, albeit in a misguided attempt to cope with his grief. With the focus now on rescuing Jasper and providing him with the care he desperately needed, Brian asked Henry to allow Jasper to be taken away for treatment and care. Henry, still overcome with emotion, agreed to let Jasper go, knowing it was for the best. However, little did they know that a sad development awaited them in Jasper's journey to recovery and a new life. As Brian and Lily made their way to the backyard to rescue Jasper, they were met with a shocking scene that the cameras hadn't captured. The stench from the area where Jasper was kept hit them hard, indicating the harsh conditions he had endured. The realization dawned on them that Jasper had been forced to defecate and urinate in the same spot where he slept, surrounded by rotting mice carcasses. The sight was distressing, highlighting the extent of cruelty Jasper had faced. When they finally cut Jasper's leash loose, expecting relief and gratitude, Jasper reacted unexpectedly. He hissed aggressively at them, and in a sudden burst of energy, Jasper darted past them, leapt over the fence, and fled into the distance. Brian and Lily were stunned by Jasper's reaction, realizing that he'd been deeply scarred by his past experiences and now saw humans as threats rather than saviors, bringing tears to their eyes. Understanding the urgency of Jasper's condition, Brian and Lily knew they had to find him quickly and get him the medical attention he needed. Jasper's injuries and the unsanitary environment he had been in posed a serious risk of infection, possibly leading to a fatal outcome if left untreated. Determined to rescue Jasper, they began their search, knowing it was a race against time to save him. Leaving Henry's house with a heavy heart, Lily had an idea sparked by Pebble. She decided to take Pebble along in their search, hoping that her bond with Jasper could lead them to his whereabouts. They started by asking neighbors if they had seen a cat around, 
but their efforts seemed futile as they received no helpful information. Just as hope was dwindling, Pebble signaled that she wanted to come down from Lily's arms. This small gesture ignited a flame of hope within them, suggesting that Pebble might be leading them to Jasper rather than simply seeking food. Brian and Lily followed Pebble's lead, their hearts filled with anticipation and determination to capture the scared cat and give him the care and safety he desperately needed. Fortunately, Pebble's keen senses led Brian and Lily to Jasper's location. When they arrived, they found Jasper standing before them, visibly distressed. As soon as he saw them, he started hissing and meowing in fear, attempting to escape from their presence. Brian, who had experience handling cats, swiftly caught Jasper before he could flee. Despite Jasper's attempts to resist by biting and scratching, Brian managed to keep him under control. They quickly returned home with Jasper, secured in a safe container. Brian and Lily wasted no time and immediately arranged for Jasper to be transported to the veterinary hospital for urgent care. Upon arrival at the hospital, Brian and Pebble stayed by Jasper's side as the veterinary staff conducted a thorough examination of his injuries and overall health. As the vet briefed them on Jasper's medical status, Brian and Lily's expressions turned somber. The vet explained that Jasper's injuries were severe and had become infected due to prolonged exposure to unsanitary conditions. This poor hygiene had contributed significantly to Jasper's deteriorating health, making his recovery a challenging process. The doctor estimated it would take a few weeks of intensive treatment and care to stabilize Jasper and improve his condition. Brian and Lily felt a mix of emotions. Relief that Jasper was receiving the medical attention he desperately needed, but also sadness and empathy for what he'd endured. They knew that Jasper's journey to recovery would be long and challenging, but they were determined to support him every step of the way. As they left the hospital, their thoughts were filled with hope for Jasper's future, knowing that with proper care and treatment, he could be restored to good health and given a chance at a happy life once again. As treatments began for Jasper, his recovery progressed swiftly. With regular visits from Brian, Lily, and Pebble, Jasper started forming a deep bond with them. Gradually, he became accustomed to their presence and stopped being aggressive as his health improved and his injuries healed. The continuous care and attention from his newfound companions played a significant role in his emotional healing as well. After a period of intensive care, Jasper was deemed ready for discharge. He underwent a complete grooming session at an animal spa, and the transformation was astonishing. Jasper's once unkempt and dirty fur now gleamed with cleanliness and health, making him almost unrecognizable from the cat that they had rescued. Brian and Lily shared a heartfelt embrace, knowing that they had rescued and rehabilitated a beautiful creature from a distressing situation. Bringing Jasper home, Brian and Lily made the decision to adopt him into their family. To their delight, Pebble, their existing cat, showed no signs of territorial aggression. Instead, she seemed to understand that Jasper was now part of their household, and the two cats quickly bonded. The harmony between Pebble and Jasper brought joy to the household, signaling the beginning of a new chapter filled with companionship and love. Lily's dad, who had previously teased Pebble as a lazy foodie cat, had a change of heart after witnessing the special bond between Pebble and Jasper. He now appreciated Pebble's unique qualities and welcomed Jasper as a cherished addition to their family. What a beautiful and heartwarming story of compassion and kindness towards animals. Have you ever rescued an animal from a dire situation? Share your experiences in the comment section below.